Hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome back to Endless Legend. Have not played the Arden Mages, so I'm dropping the difficulty down to hard, and we're going to continue from here. I'm assuming they're going to be fairly self-explanatory, except for they're not, because they have, like, weird tower mechanics. I don't even know. Uh, it'll be kind of interesting playing this faction, and I'm hoping I don't get my ass kicked. They are weak. They are soft. They writhe in supposed discomfort at minor penances that the faithful would not even notice. Their sloth will be their undoing. Without the pain, they cannot touch the power. Use your eyes, or I will remove them in atonement. See that Arda herself rise in anguish, as we all should. Join me in contrition and mortification, such as Arga has never seen. Together, we will embrace the agony and make it our servant. Okay, so we are a science faction. We also have no legs. Let's turn on uh, tiles for a second. Hmm. So do we have anything good here? You know what, let's expand out a little bit. So we've got these Telson Warriors. I really don't even know what the units do. God, the music for this faction is absurdly good. Like, really good. Is this the first time I've ever played this game? No. No, I've played... I think this is Season 7 for this game. I play a lot of it. Alright. We have found our starting zone. Look at these things. Oh, man. Look at them. Unfortunately, there's a freaking temple rune right in there, so you know what? We're gonna... Where can you move? Oh, you can move pretty far. That's pretty tempting, spot-wise. It's like next to no science on half of this terrain, though, which is bad. Science or dust? Oh, God, we're going to be poor. Hmm... I know where we're going. We're going over here. I didn't turn. Look at the resources on this place. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Kredab, I am a... I do most of my stuff on YouTube. So, if you're ever wondering if I have a game or not, it's best if you check my playlist section over there. Alright. Oof. This is possibly a little bit on the wasteful side, but we are going to plonk ourselves down right in the middle of this. Ooh, science is going to be a little bit crappy, but the resources are just so much better. Uh, right here looks perfect. Right here. Yeah, next turn. We'll, exp we'll explore around a little bit. Okay. Uh, but yeah, just to continue the Avengers thought. So there, there's like... I don't know, there, there's a lot of, like, overarching plot stuff that, like, gets thrown in. And it's really cool. It's actually, uh, probably my favorite... Favorite movie of this entire year for a very good reason. Because it's just, it's masterfully done across the board. Let's see, can you not move here? So I'll just move you out, and then you can join up. I don't I don't know what my main quest is going to be, so let's just scout around for a bit. Um, but it was just done very, very well. Hey, does this actually put me... This actually puts me up in a tiny little area. Perfect. So nobody is going to be able to get in my capital, and I'm going to be able to use and abuse a lot of resources here. It's a little bit small, but that just means we turn this entire area into a thing. Now, is this forest? No, it's Savannah. Damn it. Oh, well. It's not so bad. Ah, uh, let's see. So let's let's enter and whoa, what is this? Pillar of speed. Reducing movement costs. Good to know. Pillar of knowledge. I think we're just gonna be building a bunch of pillars of knowledge. I wonder how many I can build. Hopefully a lot. Alright, let's go for research. So one two. Three, four, five. Food? I don't, I don't even know. I got plenty of food, so I don't have to worry about it too much. Parlay with at least two villages to gather more information about your brother's death. Okay. Slain. My brother... Uh, Verda Abaz, high sunseeker of the mighty Al-Rubat clan, is struck down 
is slain, struck down by an unseen hand, and the cushion plumpers, soft-bellied priests, and the commanders who buzz around the sow shyant like flies around dung, they whisper in his ear that my hand played a part in his death. Thus I, Zor Abaz, have no choice but to flee. What dark magics my brother entwined himself with, I do not know. But what I do know is that his loyalty to our people, his loyalty to our gods, was beyond reproach. That whatever path he'd set himself on was one for the glory and protection of our people. I swear, as the stars are my witness, I will find the perpetrator and inflict upon them the ultimate penance. And more than this, I will discover my brother's quest. He will, his work will not die. We will stand united. The fiery branches lashing our bare backs. Uh, oh, we'll stand united. The fiery branches lashing our bare backs and revel in the excellency. Who will join me? All right, so we got to go parlay with some people and get some money. That's uh, like lackluster best. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to do that. Let's see. Let's take a look at her. Good reading. Yeah, story bot bots. Because okay, she's she's okay, but science boost one is not great. She's gonna be she's gonna be a hunter killer thing. Okay. I kind of wish this game had more lore. I need to play more games that involve reading. I should go back to playing Pillars of Eternity. Honestly, I just have not had the time. Maybe I'll just stream more of it. I don't know. I could also build one of these. Holy crap! That gets me a lot of resources. What about this? All of these are just going to make me swim in resources. This is why I moved over here. Oh, that looks nice. Both of these look really nice. So, 11 food, 9 food. Oh, let's go this direction. The Burrow Street's going to take a while, but... Nope. Let's keep it on food for the time being. I'm getting a lot of food here. And that's good. Ah, but, um... Yeah, no, Pillars, Pillars of Eternity would be fun. I think the only problem is, like, Pillars of Eternity involves, like, a lot of... A lot of talking, sort of? I don't even know. Uh, not a lot of talking. The tactical combat is kind of nice, but it's not, like, super, like, mouth-watering in a lot of cases. Oh, shoot. You guys are going over there, aren't you? Well, let's just take a bunch of turns. Because we're going to want to start expanding pretty fast, too. The Burrow Street is a good idea, though. Because currently we're... Oh, no, we'll get the Mill Foundry. We'll work on it along the way. But, uh... Let's see. Hey, Dorjeshi. Ah, I love me some Dorjeshi. See, so, yeah, looks like we're on this kind of, like, weird peninsula -y thing around here, which I'm very appreciative of. Let's get down here and see what we get. Ooh, what is this? A golden tree. Damn. Some of these structures are awesome. Let's search some... Search some runes. Make some dust. Buy some things. Can I Can I actually buy the mill foundry? I can. Well, that makes my life easier. I'm just a settler. Fair amount. Still, we're swimming in food, which is great. Okay, and Burrow Streets, and you level up. Okay, let's go for improved runes. Now, the problem is, like, these guys are kind of terrible city administrators. So there's a lot of, like, well, it's only science. Oh, they do they do solve unhappiness problems way better than anybody else, though. Uh, which is admittedly a gigantic boon. Still, I don't really mind. What do we get? Hello, build two extractors. Exploiting one of those following, and we get an augmented ext Holy crap, that effectively just doubles all of our, uh, all of our resources for certain things. That's awesome. I totally forgot to actually get that one. Oh, well, at least she didn't fail, so there's that. Now, what do we got down here? Is there anything down this rabbit hole? Oh, it is. Okay, so that's just a lake. It does look like we've got a fair, we've got a fairly isolated starting area, which is actually really nice. I hate when I'm surrounded, uh, but maybe that's just because I'm, I, I'm, I'm not gonna say like antisocial, but I'm antisocial. Okay, so we get settlers. So, are you kidding me? Somebody, wow! I've researched all of one technology. Somebody's already made it to tier two. How they did this, I don't know. Uh, does this include the new DLC? Oh, absolutely. I would feel weird playing a game without, uh, that's, like, not its latest incarnation, unless the latest incarnation was garbage. Okay, well, let's go with Science on Cities. Do I even have the influence? I do. Thank you. Let's just keep looping around here. I don't know how anybody can manage to do that. Unless it's another Ardent Mages, but even then, that's pretty absurd. 
looks like I've got somebody I need to murder. And murder soon. So here's the question. We do have... No tactical resources in here. That's concerning. Well, we're working on the settlers. And that will be done soon. That's a good plan. Fortunately, we don't have any... Yeah, we're going to have to just pump out settlers for a bit. Could be worse. Could be better. So you're heading for that rune. You're ignoring runes. Actually, let's not ignore runes. There's not too much of a difference. Ah, uh, let's see. Those birds are loud. Maybe that's just because I hate birds. <laughs> okay. Well, we're getting just money thrown at us left and right, which is kind of nice. Okay. I love it how when you zoom out, it turns into more of like an illustrated map style. Like, th this game does everything way more right than like any other game I've ever seen. Especially as far as like 4X strategy games. But I guess that's kind of what you, what you get when you have a... When you have a company that just is effectively makes it its business to make 4X strategy games over and over and over again. More happiness every time. Mainly because I would like to exploit that thing. Let's see, three science, two, two science, more happiness. Lots of happiness. This is a very happy area. We want to go for industry, though. Four, four, one, five. Yeah, let's just keep doing that. Fortunately, I need a lot of money to afford one of those. So let's not do that anytime soon. <laughs> Probably going to want to build another settler, come to think of it. Yep, looks like it. Okay. And no movements. Okay. Oh, activated. I have not activated a pillar. I need to do that. I need to activate all of the pillars. All right. Let's activate a one. Oh. What do, what do these pillars do? Interesting. Is this... Can I just make a bunch of these? Oh... Oh, that's awesome. So, what pillars do... Holy crap, that's cool. So, what pillars do is they have a, a range. Oh, wow. Okay, the, suddenly things make sense. So, they have a range, and they effectively just increase the science of everything around them. I don't know if I can build a burrow street on them, though. That's a bit concerning. Oh, we'll, we'll figure it out. And we made some silics. Oh, the minor factions around me are good. Oh, this is going to make life so much easier. Huh. Walk, rock within a hard place. All I have to do is just colonize this area. I like this level gen. Oh, I found orange. Might not actually get lucky here. Might not be able to get that resource. Eh, we'll figure it out. But it looks like there's a lot of big waterways here, which is going to be kind of interesting. Embarking might not be a bad idea. All right, let's settle. Speaking of settling, now that we know this, the lay of the land here. Actually, you know what? Nope, you can't do it. Let's go over here, into this region, then we'll pick it out. Hey, Soliam, you are late, but that does not matter. Okay, so we can do there, the science industry, food science industry. I really wish it would give you like a total tally. That's a lot of, that's a lot of resources though. I think that's probably the best though. It's okay, but it doesn't have the science. Yeah, our, our starting district was kind of garbage. Yeah, so looks like he's building a district right there, and we'll start with the titanium extractor. Let's see. Invalid... Oh, right, because you can't do anything. Oh, that's okay. Wow, I'm getting hammered here. I'm floored. Oh, right, because I spent so many turns wandering around. You know what? That, that probably threw me for quite the loop. Okay. Well, let's get those. Let's get all of these things. So at least now we're swimming in resources. We just killed our population real fast, though. I'm going to have to be playing catch-up. But then again, expansion-wise, I got this down pat. Let's plunk that there. Yeah, that's about the most even I can make it. You can... You know what? Fuck it. The other guy. The other guy can get out here. Here's the question. Which one of these is good? 
Oh, you know what? It's not the it's not that it's good. We need glass steel. A lot of it. You know what? I got a quest for Biangle. That's gonna take like six turns to get down there. Eh, whatever. Okay, Adkin, you start on the titanium. We're gonna need a lot of it. Probably actually should start in the mill foundry. Because that would be dumb otherwise. Okay, and you're not you're not working on anything. That's gonna take forever. I totally forgot to tell you. Wait, no, you're the wrong one. You you wanna go down to the Biegel. Biegel. Go to the bagel. We need to go colonize that bagel. Otherwise, bad things are going to happen to us. So. Wow, yeah, there's a lot of waterways here. Weird. Cool, though. I like it. Because this place has two glass steel, and it's got some pretty good regions here. Kind of right smack dab in the middle. I guess it's not nearly as good. Oh, uh, right here is real good. Hmm. Or here. Here ain't bad. <laughs> Just plonk the city down. Actually, plonking the city down on a glass deal it does count as an extractor, so there's that. Okay, so the Empire Mint's going to solve our problems. Public Library, Borough Street. Yep, yeah, we're going to be swimming in science. We're also going to need more food. That's why we're working on cultivation. Oh, forced you the rest. Yep. Totally forgot to update what game I'm playing. There we go. Problem solved. Okay. So now we got cultivation. Yeah, this is gonna fix. Oh wow, I need to play this faction more often. This is a damn good one. There we get uh, seed storage as well. Actually, let's throw that above. Center for mineralogy is nice, but I don't think I'm gonna be focusing on that anytime soon. We could also go for husbandry. Oh, we want the husbandry center really early on. Yeah, let's do that. I'm just gonna have Artem be like my kind of mega mega city, switches between like crazy science and crazy food just to expand really fast. Okay. So let's see what I wanna do. More runes. Nothing. But yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna wanna just shit settlers as much as I can. Ah, 15 titanium if I can f Oh boy. Wait, how'd that happen? Huh. I goofed. So apparently I've been adventuring with a settler. This seems like a poor plan. Especially because you need to get over here. Oh, why are you following my settler? Oh, why are you following my settler? Oh, this is bad. How did I do this? How am I so stupid? Because he was standing directly next to a ruin and I was just like, Alright, fuck it. Why not? Let's figure out what happens. And the answer is... Oh, bad. Well, now we make it to the next era. Okay. Keep running. Okay, perfect. We're okay. Uh, 16.3, 16... Wow. Why is this such garbage industry? That looks pretty perfect. We can expand some more later. And please run. Wow, this music is so good, though. Like, the singing is just so nice. Okay, so that solves that problem. Uh, and we do we do have a glass steel extractor. Should probably build it. Okay. So we're working on that. I have no idea if I'm going to get the first wonder. And if I don't, I'll be fine. I'll be a little bit disappointed, but I'll be fine. Uh, let's see. I'll be able to get another science thing, and I've made it up to the next era. Do I need any of these? I should probably go for parlay, shouldn't I? Oh, I already have parlay. Train with river. Nope, let's go with the the extractors. Then, uh, let's go with that. I'll figure it out from here. Hydrology will take two. Honestly, if I can get hydrology working, in fact, almost to the point where... Might not be a bad idea. Ah, uh, you're probably gonna get your ass kicked, aren't you? 
Kind of even. I got him! Yay! Turns out I'm not super crappy. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna want to look into equipping our guys, but seeing as I don't have much for glacial production right now, it's pretty bad. Oh, well, at least we automatically heal. That's kind of nice. And we get 15 moon leaf. Moon can't use it. I need 20. Damn it. Okay. So you, you get over here. Let's start parlaying. Okay, three minor faction units, and we will convert them. Okay, that's good to know. We'll get Hydrology in one. We're also losing money like crazy. I don't remember if there's a negative or not for doing this. So I do not know what that's going to do. Science! Oh, whoa. Apparently, for every one of those you put it down on... Wow, that helps a lot. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to just put people on dust, just because otherwise we're kind of doomed. But yeah, those those pillars are absurd. Because you can just stack them like crazy. Hey, Gunship. Yeah, this is Endless Legend. It's very Civ-like. But it's better in almost all ways, as far as I'm concerned. Unfortunately, I can only afford one of these, and it's gonna have to be science. Okay. Let's see, so you're working on that. Why are, why are you working on that instead of the seed storage? Right, and you need to build everything. I need more industry. Holy crap. Then again, it's also winter, so there's that. I have nobody focused on industry. Can I, can I buff that up? I can buff that up a little bit. Let's make that... Yeah, that helps a lot. Okay. So let's think. We need to parlay. We need more villages. Oh, you're heading here next. And unfortunately, it's winter. Good luck. And I might as well send you up very slowly to rejo rejoin the faction. Uh, rejo rejoin the group. Otherwise, we're going to be running around with two pretty cra Landscaping. Don't know what that is. Interesting question. Okay. I still don't have any resources. And I'm being attacked by some bows. Ah, crap. Well, we lose the Tesla Morrier, but we do win. I can make more of those. Okay, so you're working on the husbandry center. Then we'll get the center. Ah, I can throw the center of mineralogy at the bottom. It's not going to help me that much. Then we can get an emerald extractor. But the problem is emeralds are actually the most useless of all. Which is kind of annoying. Wow, we research fast. Did not realize that. Hello, what is this? Pillar of influence. Plus one to five influence on tiles within the pillar's range for ten turns. Okay, so the way pillars work is they're limited duration. It makes sense. Well, let's go for uh, food next. Actually, science, and then food, and then roads, and then influence. Actually, influence, then road. In fact, there we go. And our science has failed us. But then again, that's not so bad. And it is summer again. How much does this cost on Steam? It is 30 bucks on Steam. Okay, Pillar of Knowledge is to have run out. That's okay. Ah, uh, you're retreating. You're retreating very hard. You, they're in the way. You're retreating this direction. They have flying. That concerns me. Okay, so we get Husbandry Center. That's fine. We need that. Because that's going to triple my growth practically and we're gonna need that for the main city I'm not getting any of it. I'm not getting those wonders unfortunately let's roll you south maybe maybe we'll get lucky and can get our guy hey I can also parlay with this this faction can't I all right troops nearby go to the ruins marked with dust oh wait shoot that was the faction quest oh well uh, reliable ally don't put any influence in military Economy and population ministry to level one. All right, that should be easy enough, and we get pa pacification. All right, so let's let's go back and take a look at our quest. Let's see. Oh, I guess we didn't actually finish the quest. Well, there we go. We gotta go find a rune marked in dust. Oh, all the way over there. Hey, that's not actually a bad plan, considering I should probably explore my own 
own district. It's actually a much larger district than I give it credit for. Uh, the one thing I will say, though, is Gunship, even though it look, uh, even though it's kind of expensive to begin with, it's frequently on sale for at least uh, for down to seventeen dollars, which isn't so bad. At least as far as I'm concerned, especially for the amount of hours that I get out of this game, this is damn good. All right, so we get the husbandry center. Somebody has built the museum of Riga. I am jealous, but then again, these guys. I didn't have a very good early game start. We'll get the canal system, then we'll get the canal locks, and we're going to be shitting population, which is good. Actually, should probably... How much is this going to cost me? 53. Alright. That's... Science. Up. It's going to be very expensive, but awesome. I'm definitely keeping that, that in mind for the future. Okay. I think I've got a gold ex Do I have a gold extractor? I'm gonna be surprised if I do. Unless... It'll tell me, won't it? Yeah, plus two, plus two per turn from a city. So I must have dumped... Uh, oh yeah, Golquin is directly on top of gold production. Hey, that works for me. Okay. Let's see. So you'll make it up there. You'll make it up there. I'm a little bit worried of the minor, about the minor factions rolling in. Wow, yeah, we're going to get a lot of gold here. That's exactly what we need. Because if I can have just crazy pillars all over the place, that's going to give us some serious science boosts. Because uh, now, now that we're kind of out of the early game doldrums, we should be... We should be better off. Okay, so you're, you're working on that. Anything I can do? No population in the next turn. Actually, in that case, population in the next turn is going to happen anyway, isn't it? Let's get a bit of an industry boost. Yeah, because I'm, I'm glad I'm not playing serious difficulty. I think we'd be having some trouble otherwise. After you're done with that, let's build another settler and a gold extractor. Because that money is going to be hella useful. Okay. Let's do some explorations. Watch there be like a node that's just like absurdly, absurdly good up here. Doesn't look like it though. We'll go for the runes. I'm worried about the rogue troops thing just because my uh my army is small. My army is effectively God damn it, just run. These minor faction units are just driving me batty. Can you make it? Nope, he can't make it. He's gonna get his shit kicked in next turn. Well. Guess I'll deal with it. Wait, is that glass steel? That is glass steel. Well. Looks like you've got a new new purpose. Okay, working on the center of mineralogy. Actually, I could buy that. For 97, let's do it. workshop because I need the I need that well before I need anything else once we get that canal locks we really don't have much to worry about like let's uh chunk down our dust production let's see if I can get this five turns that's good enough thank you gunship thank you for saying that gunship is saying that I play a lot of games you, you would get uh, that he would get and uh, love let's see and uh, fuck uh, what, they're attacking my might sit Ah, uh, crap. Well, there goes my hero. Disabled for 10 turns. How much would it cost to re restore? That's money. Okay, and you're going to retreat and die. Ah, oh, man, the minor factions are wrecking me right now, which is bad. I didn't focus on military, and I split, th split them up. Uh, note to self, next time, don't do that. Oh shoot, an orange is, orange is getting feisty. I don't like that. Oh well. I'll have to get I'll have to get very militant as we go along here. Because the nice thing is, science-wise, we're gonna be good. Dust-wise, we'll probably be okay. Like we got some really nice starts. We just have to Oh, that's that's super bad. Please do not just start trying to take my city. If they start taking my city, I'm pretty much boned. There's not much I can do do about the situation for the time being. Oh, night double. Have a good one. Pillar of Knowledge has run out. 
Hmm. I don't have the money for it right now. The anything for it. Okay. Or the Empire would probably be good. I'll just keep moving the center of mineralogy down. But once we get that canal lock, everything else just kind of falls into place. Let's see, what are you working on? Glass deal. Okay, that, that'll help. We'll go with the canal system. You are not... Oh, you're all working on growth. That would explain things. Let's switch a little bit over to industry. And I am not used to playing as uh, not the Broken Lords. The Broken Lords make everything super simple. This, not so much so. Hey, I can afford both. So, economy and population. Somebody gets that. Alright, yeah, no, people are bypassing me like crazy. Economy and population, then all we have to do is go back to that town, and it's not gonna work. Okay. That's fine, one more turn. We get what we need. And I should still be able to get uh, Yith, at the very least. I don't even know who Orange is. Which is kind of concerning. Also, looks like we got a couple other places that I can expand to. Oh. Oh, they're already pacified. Is it the boats that are pacified? I don't know. I don't know when I will know. Holy crap, that solves problems. Let's get right away. So that'll be one person per turn. So let's, let's dump that down a little bit. Slow it down. Just a tad. Let's go for a little bit of growth. Okay. Now, you just need a little bit. Let's assign to city... Artem. I'll just give a nice little science boost for the time being. Because once I churn, churn through the basic number of structures, then we can start pumping up military units. And once, once we actually have, like, a proper army, I won't have anything to worry about. Okay, so yeah, one, 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 except for right away, which takes two, apparently. Okay, it's not so bad. So yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna kind of ham out some uh, turns here. Because we need science. We need money. If I was making money, it would be great, but I'm not. And there goes the last of my pillar of knowledges. Those are expensive. Never quite properly processed that. Settler in three. Oh, you know what? If you're got, if you're not getting any population, let's uh, make that faster. I really wish actually just pouring everything into food would make all that stuff go faster too. Oh, well. oh public granary, public library, Empire Mint. Actually, Empire Mint should be a really high priority here. You need that. Also, we have a titanium extractor. All right, Golkwin was actually a pretty good choice for accident accidentally settling. Ah, uh, let's see. See. So Center of Mineralogy. You know what? Let's dump that down a little bit. Comparatively, do not need. Can I get that in one? No, I can't get that in one. Well, let's just alternate, because, yeah, I, I don't have anybody put on science right now anyway. Okay. Science! Speaking of, we should probably do that. Ah, uh, let's see. We already got Glory of the Empire. We should probably go for Central Market and... Sewer system. Actually, sewer system, then central market. Um, then probably the mercenary market. At least we got a lot of other stuff. Let's see. Uh, some complexity in speed? Uh, do you mean what? I don't actually know exactly what that means. Uh, if you want to elucidate on that one. Alright, let's, let's go with management sciences, too. I don't know how fast we research. I guess without those pillars, we don't research very fast. Also, apparently nobody's tried building the uh, industrial megapole yet, which is kind of interesting. Oh, well, that solves these problems. And she's apparently leveled up. Let's let's keep going with this, because the science boost gives plus four science per level. She's, what, level four, so that's 16 science. Eh, it's not terrible. It doesn't actually make that much of a difference at this point. Probably would made, would have made more of a difference. Why do you not have... The, well, you know what? Let's just build the Borough Street. Uh, we're probably going to need the resources anyway. And now we're losing crazy money. You know what? Let's toss one of you over here. Problem solved. Oh, slows everything down a little bit, though. Oh, well. The extra resources from this district help. 
A lot. Okay, and... Ooh, ooh, that's gonna help our influence. I don't know where the next in... Mm -hmm. Oh, shoot, did somebody already built the industrial mega bowl? Damn it. Alright, fine. Let's build the sewer system. Let's build another Burrow Street. Keep expanding like crazy. I guess we might as well get this. Yeah, we're not doing nearly as well this run, but then again, my Broken Lord's faction is just... kind of ungodly, comparatively. Let's see. Yeah, more emeralds. Gold? No, I already got the gold. We can go right away? I don't know. Because I, I already did get that. No, you're working on the public granary. Alright, that's a good to, thing to know. There's so many things to build. Not enough time. You have a settler. You just finished a settler. Like a turn or two ago. Let's head them down here. Hopefully none of the minor faction units are close enough so it doesn't actually bother me too much. Ah, uh, let's see. So one, 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 one. Perfect. Okay. So, we're going to be swimming in influence, which means we can unlock some of the bigger bonuses. Yep, they're coming for me. But you ain't having me. Leave me alone. <laughs> that was actually kind of close. The problem is, like, the minor faction units move. Ah, uh, bef kind of before you do, which is kind of garbage. Hey, the nice little influence bonus thing means I know exactly where all of the, uh... Anomalies are all the good ones and it looks like they're all concentrated right here. So I know exactly what I'm gonna be doing Um, So we got roads coming in any of these no, yeah, you're working on that aren't you? Is this gonna slow down a little bit it is but that means population one which is exactly what we're looking for And finally we'll get the center of mineralogy Maybe just shit science on things for a second. Yeah, that doesn't seem like a terribly good idea though <laughs> Okay, a glimpse of a new era. Yes, somebody is wildly outsciencing me. I am not playing this faction right, but then again, losing those like initial three, four turns is crucial and very painful. Note to self, next time just ignore it. Build up what you have. Because uh, honestly, the, the starting anomalies are nice, but they're not wor worth the uh, turn loss. Okay, so we get the uh, extra person, people in five. How fast can I build the population? Otherwise, nah, it's not worth it. I'm still working on that Cent center of mineralogy for no good reason. Okay. Shoot. Oh, this is bad. There's a lot of Burdecki around here. Well, at least if they attack me, they're attacking me from the convenient location, because I don't need to care about that direction. Okay. I feel like this is that one Draken mission all over again, which is kind of butts. Oh well. It's not the worst. Let's, let's go with the happiness that gives a bit of a production boost. You are just working on whatever the heck you want, don't, aren't you? And there's no way I'm going to be able to do that. Ah, oh, the research cost reduction would be great. Oh well. guess can't always pursue wonders and honestly the wonders aren't even that like big of a boon here ah crap we are going to be running into some serious money issues so I can figure out how to fix it and oh we get the augmented extractor you know what come to think of it I might actually have a foot run how much health do you have these Burdecki came right around. Not for the best. I don't like it, but it's better than losing him. And we'll get some more as we go along. Ah, it hurts a little. Okay. So what's the next empire plan? Oh, you know what I just realized? I got people... Let's just get money. Some money. There we go. Now we're in the positive. And if we get the central market, that should solve some of our problems. Um... I can get a watchtower here. Nope. I can, I can make one. 
probably want to do is tell some warriors. Let's actually upgrade them so they're at the very least wearing tier 2 equipment. Because otherwise it's just kind of a waste of time. What is this? Strike back? Really? Didn't know they had sweep strike back. Odd. Sort of like a weird ass back thing. And apparently they're just wearing underwear. I originally thought they looked like cool martial arts monks. Turns out, not actually the case. Okay. Well, in that case, you guys are working on that, you guys are working on that. You know what, if we're doing this during the winter, let's just switch over to building. Yeah, that'll be faster. Okay, you get a hero in this? How does it work? Uh, uh your hero has like... I mean, your hero's kind of like, uh, it's like Warcraft 3. Where you get like a bunch of, um... Oh, hey. Do I have, I have a lot of influence here. That's really useful. Let's do that for the time being. Because that'll make building faster. Uh, so you guys are working on that. You guys are working on that. Okay. In this case, let's have a, a team of four warlocks. And I think we just... I think we just ranked up. Yep, Age of Enlightenment. Okay. So that means we're going to have to redo things. Eh. So Red looks to be cleaning house right now. Duke must have got a really lucky spawn. Management Sciences is good. Let's, let's do this. And then Management Sciences. And then these two. Because we need dust real bad. Otherwise we're in trouble. So next, this is going to solve our... Oh, that solves our problems. Oh, that solves all of our problems. So in that case, yeah, we're good. Perfect. Okay, so now what we're going to do... Wait, let the dust roll in and get some more science here. Oh, really? Price really drops. Okay, well, let's get another one of these then. Probably shouldn't do that. No, well, and I failed that objective, which means somebody just took Bagel. Damn it, Bagel. Is this game just fantasy setting? It's like fantasy sci-fi. It's a little bit of both. Did I just get... I just did. Wow. Or, no. What? What What am I even researching? No. There we go. I was working on that. Whoops. Let's get another one of these science sciencey buildings. I really wish you could actually build these on pre-established districts, but oh well. That gives me crazy town science. Still not enough, though. Kind of a shame. Right, so we've got a couple of warlocks. Let's assign a hero. Time that I actually go do this faction-specific quest that I wanted to do a long time ago. Yeah, and I should I should be getting, especially if I can go down and like beat the tar out of the Dorjeshi, I get eight, oh wow, I get eight gold per turn. Well, I need to go, I need to go beat on some uh, Berdecki. I guess I know what I'm doing. Come dawn. Also come more military units. Because I want to... Oh, man. So they give you extra resources per whatever. So, orange is concerning. Who are you guys? Orcs. Is this an orc village? It is an orc village. Dicks. I, oh, you didn't finish. Damn it. You know what? They're probably not going to be assisted. Is this worth it? I have no idea. Auto! I crushed them. Okay, speaking of, I have not upgraded you. I have not upgraded... We just got tier 3 and I have not upgraded anybody. This is bad because we're not going for... Oh god, this is like one of the slowest starts I've ever gotten. Still. So slow down, exhaustion, or unsteady. Prefer unsteady, personally. I don't have the money for that. Well, let's get rid of these boots. And then give her unsteady. Get rid of the uh, the helmet. There we go. There goes all my money. It'll have to do.